Some monster bug wars are a battle of wits and strategy. Other conflicts are won with brute strength and raw power. When an ogre-faced spider and an army ant soldier face off, it's brains versus brawn. In the bug world, take nothing for granted. Shape-shifting assassins can appear anywhere. With long spindly legs and an elongated body, the ogre-faced spider does a perfect twig impression. During the day when the ogre-faced spider isn't actually hunting, they hang in the grass. They have their legs extended, so they look like a twig or grass. And they're trying to avoid looking like something that's edible. Camouflage isn't the spider's only weapon. When night falls, the ambush predator starts knitting. The ogre-faced spider has something that's absolutely unique in the animal kingdom. They build a web that they literally throw over their prey. This web is almost like a gladiator throwing out a net and capturing its prey. Hanging upside down in midair, tiny claws clinging to silken guy ropes. The ogre-faced spider waits, ready to spread her deadly picnic blanket. The ogre's eyesight can pinpoint almost any target, even in darkness. Two of its eight eyes are like night vision goggles, giving this nocturnal hunter better night vision than even owls or cats. Nearby, an army is on the march. Nomadic, carnivorous, voracious. An army ant colony is a terrifying force. Within this deadly swarm, the most powerful of all are the soldiers. These special ops bugs are bred for war. Army ant swarms are giant, precisely coordinated military machines and the soldier ants are its attack dogs, except in ant terms, they're about the size of horses. Soldier ants are built for attack. Large heads support the biggest mandibles in the ant world. Curved like fish hooks with razor sharp points, they spear and crush. At the other end, a needle-like steam delivers paralyzing venom in repeated stabs. The army ant sting is very potent, but it isn't used all the time. Often, just the mandibles are enough for the bullying business. But if an opponent fights back, then the stinger is used like a taser set to kill. Even alone, army ant soldiers are fierce opponents. This giant ground spider seems like an invincible foe. But the army ant soldier has superior one-on-one -on -one tactics. It latches onto the back of the spider's abdomen. The muscles in the soldier's head are so strong, it's almost impossible to get those jaws open once they've clamped down on something. The soldier ant can even be torn in half, and he won't let go. The spider tries to dislodge its opponent but its fangs can't reach back far enough. The ant stinger's toxic venom paralyzes the spider's muscles and nerves. It's a great meal for the colony. But what happens when the lone warrior confronts the master netcaster? 
other predators are understandably hesitant to mess with a army ant soldier, this ogre-faced spider is more than willing to entangle. Next, vicious mandibles versus a deadly net. And later, the baddest bugs in town slug it out. On the rainforest floor, a lost army ant soldier trying to find its battalion strays into the drop zone of an ogre-faced spider. The spider attacks with its gladiatorial net and toxic venom. The army ant fights with its terrifying mandibles and paralyzing steam. Who will emerge the victor? The soldier ant wanders into dangerous territory. The spider's huge eyes are trained on the approaching target. The net first scoops up the huge mandibles, disabling the ant's primary weapon. But a soldier ant isn't any bug. It's special ops. There'll be no surrender. This army ant has strong, sickle-like jaws. It's got a powerful sting. It could do real damage to the ogre face spider. Despite being wrapped up, the army ant can still land a lethal sting. It waits for its opportunity. The spider, too, is choosing its moment. It takes a chance. One bite through the silk sends venom coursing through the ant's body. This soldier's fighting days are over. Its innards are turned to mush and sucked out. All that's left is a shrink-wrapped shell. One more casualty in a never-ending bug war. 